Oh, hello. I uh, didn't see you there. Welcome to my office. And um, here, let me show you around. As you can see, this is my ginormous table, and uh, I spend a lot of time just really working hard and focused on, you know, administration and taking care of, of church work. And over here is my uh, bookshelf, and there's a lot of books on um, theology, and I'm just super well read. I try to really get on the cutting edge of, of that stuff. And lastly, here's my bean bag, and this is where I really kick up my kick off my shoes and relax and and think about God, you know, pray and, and work on my sermons. Hey, since you're here, let me tell you about a medical uh, mission trip that I'm going to in the next couple weeks. We are traveling to Vietnam, January 18 to 26, and um, as a team, we have some very specific objectives. First, we hope to share the gospel with uh, the Vietnamese people, and the whole country has about only 1% Christian, so we're really excited to go and to tell about the good news of Christ. We're doing that by partnering with local churches, and we really believe that we want to empower the local church through doing medical missions, uh, teaching English, and also during the nighttime, we'll be doing evangelistic events um, to share Christ and to, and to really worship Him. So hopefully during our time of partnering with the local churches, they'll gather people for us. And as we do medical missions and teaching English, all the people we meet there, we can bring to those events and really um, have like a nice concert environment and also share Jesus with those people. Also, um, here are some of my personal objectives there. I'll be teaching English in the morning. I'm also uh, the worship leader with um, a team of about five people, a keyboardist, drummer. I'm playing gu the guitar and then also Chad's doing bass. I'll be preaching some of the sermons and um, I'm also the assistant team leader or as Pastor Ray says, um, the assistant to the team leader. But they're pretty similar, I think. Here's the schedule that we're running. We'll be waking up around 6 a.m. and then we'll do conversational English all the way till about 5 p.m. So almost 11 hours with the lunch break. Um, that's with uh, the city people. And then um, after that, we're going to be doing an evangelistic event from 6 to 10 p.m. So about four hours, sorry, 7 to 10 p.m., about four hours. And there we'll be doing an extended worship, sharing our testimonies, and also giving the gospel message. That's our first team. The second team is made up of a doctor, um, a nurse, a pharmacist, and also a um, dentist. And they'll be going to the remote villages of Vietnam. So they're actually going to be traveling two to three hours one way a day to get to these remote villages. And they'll be setting up medical clinics there. Afterward, they'll be coming home for dinner, and then we'll be doing the evangelistic event together. So th this is our whole mission trip, and um, I'm just really excited to go. I feel like God's given us such a great opportunity and um, to partner together in so many different fields of expertise to reach people for God. So um, this last month or so, we've been meeting every week uh, to prepare for the mission trip, and we'll be leaving soon. And um, I really want to ask for your prayers because we're going to a foreign country and if you could just pray for our safety as we travel, um, our health uh, as we're eating lots of pho, and um, also our spiritual well-being that our team would have prepared our heart, would be in unity, and um, we really feel like you know there's going to be a lot of spiritual warfare and we want to be able to um, pray through that. Also. Um, just ask God that our time there would be very fruitful, that a lot of people would come to know Him, and that the local church there would be encouraged, that they would know that our family expand, extends um, throughout the earth. And um, if you want to also support our medical uh, missions trip, we are all about fundraising about $1,500 per person, including um, airfare and also our time there. So um, if you want to support us, please look at the email and um, it will give you a lot of detailed information on how to do that. Um, thank you so much for visiting my office and I hope that you have a great Christmas and a Happy New Year.